I've reached out to President Roulon of France uh, and hope to have the opportunity to talk to him today. But I thought it was appropriate for me to express my deepest sympathies uh, to the people of Paris and the people of France for uh, the terrible terrorist attack that took place uh, earlier today. I think that uh, all of us uh, recognize that uh, France is one of our oldest allies, uh, our strongest allies. Uh, they have been uh, with us uh, at every moment when we, uh, from 9-11 on, uh, in dealing with uh, you know, some of the terrorist organizations around the world that threaten us. Uh, for us to see the kind of cowardly, uh, evil attacks that took place today, uh, I think, uh, reinforces uh, once again uh, why it's so important for us to stand in solidarity with them, uh, just as they stand in solidarity with us. Uh, the fact that this was an attack uh, on uh, journalists, an uh, attack on our free press, uh, also underscores the degree to which uh, these terrorists fear freedom of speech and freedom of the press. But the one thing that I'm very confident about is that uh, the values that we share with the French people, uh, a belief, a universal belief uh, in freedom of expression, uh, is something that uh, can't be uh, silenced uh, because of the senseless violence uh, of the few. Uh, and so uh, our counterterrorism cooperation with France is uh, excellent. Uh, we will provide them with every a bit of assistance that we can going forward. Uh, I think it's going to be important for us to make sure that uh, we recognize these kinds of uh, attacks uh, can happen uh, anywhere in the world. And one of the things I'll be discussing with Secretary Kerry today is to make sure that we remain vigilant, not just with respect to uh, Americans living in Paris, uh, but uh, Americans living in Europe and in the Middle East and other parts of the world, making sure that we stay vigilant uh, in trying to protect them. Uh, and to hunt down and bring the perpetrators of this specific act of justice and to roll up the networks uh, that uh, help to advance uh, these kinds of plots. Um, in the end, though, uh, the most important thing I want to say is uh, that uh, our thoughts and prayers are with the families of those uh, who've been lost in France uh, and with the people of Paris and the people of France. What uh, that beautiful city represents, uh, the, the culture and the, um, the civilization that uh, you know, is so central to our imaginations, uh, that's going to endure. Uh, and uh, those who uh, carry out senseless attacks against innocent civilians, um, ultimately they'll be forgotten. Uh, and we will stand with the people of France. Um, through this very, very difficult time. Thank you very much, everybody.